Hi, I'm Brian Strausser, Principal and Chief Executive here at BrightPath. And in this week's video for our weekly insights, we'll be talking about five areas of potential concern for geopolitical risk for businesses in 2024. These are areas that stand out to us as potential concern for businesses, particularly those that are operating in complex global environments. Here are five key areas, and then we'll have some analysis at the end. The first is the drop in what we would refer to as the global democracy, global democratic uh, recession. Not an economic recession, but a notable decline in global freedom and democracy. And this continues a trend observed over the past several years. This trend has been marked by military coups, restrictions on freedom of expression, and the rise of far-right parties in Europe. And these lead to political instability and unpredictability in various regions. These environments can impact business operations, regulatory compliance, and market accessibility. Number two is the space race and militarization. That there's intensifying competition in space exploration and utilization, notably between countries and private entities, which is something new. This raises concern around the militarization of space and the absence of comprehensive rules or treaties that govern space operations. This escalation poses risks in terms of geopolitical rivalries and operational challenges for businesses that are engaged in or are reliant upon space-based technologies and communication. And to some extent, we're all reliant upon space-based communication, but for those of you that are more directly impacted, this will be a bigger concern. Number three is India's ongoing population growth. India will surpass, India has surpassed China as the world's most populous country, and this has significant geopolitical implications. This democratic shift presents India with both opportunities and challenges. India's younger growing population could drive economic growth, but it also poses challenges in terms of resource allocation, market dynamics, and regional power balances. Businesses may need to adapt their strategies in the, this changing landscape, especially in Asia. Number four is Azerbaijan. There's recent conflict in Azerbaijan and around Azerbaijan uh, that has led to significant regional instability. This conflict, which has also involved countries like Russia and Turkey, could lead to broader regional tensions impacting businesses with interests in the area and neighboring regions. It's critical, it's crucial for businesses rather, to monitor this situation closely for developments that may affect regional security and economic stability. And number five is US-China tensions. That the ongoing tensions between the United States and China, particularly in areas like trade, technology, and regional influence, continue to create a complex and challenging environment for businesses. The lack of clear communication challenges, clear communication channels, and the potential for escalating conflicts, especially around technology and trade restriction, navigation and freedom of the seas, all require businesses to be agile and adaptable in these strategies. In addition to these five areas of focus, uh, a recent report from Ernst & Young on their 2024 geostrategic outlook identifies a few other risks worth mentioning. And that is the increased complexity of the geopolitical environment due to the idea of multipolarity, meaning that it's no longer just East and West or U.S. and the Soviet Union, of course, but now there's multiple spheres of influence. The need to de-risk the global supply chain in response to recent disruptions. The evolving geopolitics around artificial intelligence and its impact on international relations and business strategies. The rising importance of ocean geopolitics affecting trade routes, supply chains, and resource access. And finally, the global election super cycle in 2024, which will bring regulatory and, and policy uncertainty here in the United States and across several other markets that will see elections in 2024. All of these areas highlight the importance of strategic foresight and agility in navigating the complex geopolitical landscape in 2024. As an executive, as an industry leader in resilience, staying informed and proactive across these domains will be essential for steering your organization properly through these challenges and making plans from a continuity, crisis management, and resilience standpoint to address these challenges. That's it for this week's Weekly Insight. We'll be back next week with another new video. Be well. 
Thanks for watching our video. To learn more about how to manage uncertainty and disruption in your organization, be sure to like, follow, and subscribe to our video channel. And here are a few more videos that we've selected that will help you learn more about business continuity, crisis management, and crisis communications.